Welcome back to the series where I test the old school RuneScape wiki's money making methods. And if you like these videos, feel free to check out the playlist in the description box down below. But with that being said, let's jump into today's video. Welcome to season 8 of Test Neris House Wiki Money Making Methods. And today's money maker is going to be mixing Haralander potions. The requirements you need to be able to do this method are the following. Most importantly, you'll need to have completed the Druidic Ritual quest and to have a herb level of at least 22. This is so you can actually mix these potions. Secondly, you'll want to have at least 2 million coins in starting capital. This is so we can buy all of the supplies we need to be able to do this method efficiently for one hour. But now let's go over my inventory. As we are bank standing in today's video, we do not have a gear set up. But for my inventory, you'll want to have 14 vials of water, 14 clean Haralander herbs. And to do this method, all you have to do is use one on the other and then press your space bar. But now let's go over some information about this method. A Haralander potion is an unfinished potion made by using a Haralander on a vial of water. And this will require the player to have at least a level 22 in the herb loss skill, so then it can be mixed. Because these are often used to train herb lore, and adding a clean Haralander to a vial of water doesn't give any experience, then a lot of players will avoid doing this and instead will buy them directly from the Grand Exchange. And because players will decide to do this, this opens up an opportunity for us to mix these potions for profit. And as of this recording, you can make around 70 coins in profit per potion that you mix. Haralander potions, like the majority of other potions, can have a secondary supply added to them. And I will just list off the ones that can be added to these Haralander potions. If the player decides to use a volcanic ash with one of these potions, then that will result in a compost potion being mixed, and this will grant the player with 60 herb lore experience. Also, with level 22 herb lore, the player can decide to make a restore potion, and to do that, they will need to add a red spider egg to their Haraland potion. And once they have done this, the player will then be granted with 62.5 experience. At level 26 herb lore, the player can use a pile of chocolate dust with their Haralander potion. And once this is mixed, this will turn into an energy potion and the player will be granted with 67.5 experience. And finally, when the player manages to reach level 36 herb lore, then they have the opportunity to mix goat horn dust with these Haralander potions to make a combat potion. And if the player decides to do this, then they will be granted with 84 herb lore experience. But do bear in mind, if you decide to mix any of these potions, then you will more than likely lose all the profit you were set to gain from doing this money maker. So I would instead just recommend for you to sell these unfinished Haralander potions to the Grand Exchange. But with all that being said, let's jump on over to the final price check so we can see how many potions we've managed to mix over this one hour. And then we can see how much money it will be given away in today's video. Only 4% of you who are watching these videos are subscribed. So if you aren't already, smash that sub button so you can be notified when new videos are going live. Hello and welcome to the final price check of making Haralander potions. And here in my event is all of the potions we have managed to make over this one hour. So over this one hour, we managed to make 3,920 Haralander potions. So if now we bring up the calculator, then we can see our investment for this video. So for our investments for this video, we paid 419 coins each for the Haralanders and 4 coins each for the vials of water. So in the calculator, if we go and type in 419, we times that by the amount of Haralanders we made, which was 3,920. That will give us our biggest investment, which was 1,642,480 GP. So we go ahead and copy that number. Then if we go ahead and type in 3920 times that by the price of one vial of water which is four coins and then that is 15,680 GP. Then if we go ahead and add that to the price of that each Haralander, our investment for this video was 1,658,160 GP. Now we'll go ahead and just copy that number. Now we can go ahead and just put this in the price check. So one hour of mixing Haralander potions comes out to be 2,073,680 GP. So now if we go back to the calculator, type in that number which is 200. 73680. We go ahead and take away the investment, which was 
1658160. So the profit we're made and the amount of money we're giving away in today's video is 415,520 GP. And like always, that money will be going away to one of you guys. Now let's jump on over to the spinning wheel so we can see who'll be taking away this money. Subscribe to save this data. Welcome to the spinning wheel. We currently have 17 entries and I'm pretty sure we have a decent amount of new entries from the previous video. Our first new entry is Devon, then we have Lieutenant Walsh, then we have Zekadus, then we have Curtis Sawyer, and the final two new entries is The Crodman and Mike1794. So good luck to everyone who has entered correctly. Then we will just go ahead and spin this wheel. And it looks like today's winner of all profits is going to be, it looks like it is going to be Curtis Sawyer. So congratulations to you. You are today's winner of all profits. And to claim your winnings, all you have to do is message me in game. My in game name is BROSRS. It is the exact same as my YouTube name. But with that being said, let's jump on over to the leaderboard so we can see where this moneymaker ranks. Welcome to the moneymaker leaderboard. On this leaderboard, I ranked the money makers after I tried them, and I split it into four columns. The first column is for the method I was using. The second column is for the money this method has earned me. Column three is for the order the videos rank in compared to the order I released the videos in. And column four is for difficulty, as if they are hard to do, they will rank it as red hard. And likewise, if they are easy to do, then I will rank it as green easy. And for any other methods that fall in between both of these, these will be ranked as yellow medium. This is for my medium tier. So today's moneymaker was mixing the Harolander potions. This netted us a profit of 415,520 GP. This is episode 8 on season 8 and I ranked this moneymaker as easy to do. I ranked this as easy to do because all you needed was a druidic ritual quest and level 22 herb lore. And then all you need is a bit of money. Let's say you don't have all the money you needed to do this method efficiently and you're earning half of it. You could easily buy half the materials, use them, make all your profit, sell them and buy more and rinse and repeat. Today's run up was Curtis Sawyer. So congratulations to you once again. But I hope you guys have all enjoyed this moneymaker. If you have enjoyed, please like, comment, subscribe. It really will help the channel grow. I hope you guys have all enjoyed nevertheless. I've been Ben and I'll catch you in the next moneymaker. Goodbye. If you guys are looking around for your newest game, make sure to check out cdkeys.com because they have the cheapest CD keys available on the internet for pretty much every game, even new releases. I'll drop a link down below if you guys want to check them out.